Hey everyone! Just wanted to take a couple minutes to go over the items that you need to complete for homework here in week 6. When you click on the week 6 homework assignments tab in the week 6 module, first thing you're going to see is that you need to read chapter 11. Chapter 11 is the chapter from our book that goes over compare and contrast writing. So it corresponds to the lesson here in week 6. Use chapter 11 as little or as much as you need to. Right? The next item is, of course, the week six journal. So for week six, I want you to think about how to plan the perfect party or get together. It can be a really big, huge, extravagant party, or it can be just like a family barbecue. All right? Choose one of those types of events, some type of party or get together, and explain the steps that you take to make it happen. Right? What are all the things that you need to do to plan a party? You know, what is the process, the preparations, the supply list, the events and entertainment, the food and drinks, etc. If you were going to explain to someone else how to plan the perfect party or get together, how would you explain your process? Take us through the steps. Try to write for, you know, eight to ten minutes nonstop if you can, even if you go off topic. But the idea here is to go through step by step how you would plan a party, right? Let's try to have that submitted Sunday night by 11.59. The next item that you're gonna see is writing assignment two, compare and contrast paragraph. There will be a video in the instructions for writing assignment two that explains in way more detail what you need to do to complete that assignment, just like last week with writing assignment one, okay? Then of course, the last item for homework this week is the week six discussion. And for week six, you're going to be thinking about the roles we play. So, pretty much on a daily basis, or you know, at least on a regular basis, we all take on different roles in our life. We might be a student on some days. So some days we have to play the role of student. We have to play the role of parent. We have to play the role of sibling. We play the role of friend. We play the role of employee. Maybe we even play the role of boss, right? I want you to think about several roles, go with three, three roles that you play on a fairly regular basis and describe to us what each role consists of, all right? Um, you know, so if you are a student, if that's one of the roles you're gonna talk about, what does it mean to be a student? How does that role um, look? How would you describe that role? Same thing if, you're, if one of your roles is as a parent. What does that role look like? What does it consist of? All right, so choose three and tell us about them. If you want to have a paragraph I'd say at least eight to ten sentences long, um, maybe even a little longer. Right. But try to have your first post up by Thursday night and respond to two classmates before it closes Sunday night at 11.59. Um, if you have any questions about this week's homework, let me know. If you run into any technical difficulties, let me know. And just remember that there is a separate video in the instructions for week two, or I'm sorry, for writing assignment two, the compare contrast paragraph. Please be sure to watch that video. All right? You guys are free to go ahead and get started on everything.